business perspective. So let me introduce the presenter today, who is Mr. Kripanand Chidambaram, the co-founder of Business Leadership League, who will lead our business perspective segment, talking on reimagining your website content. So I would like to invite you, Casey, as what we address you all the time, to take this segment ahead for us. Thank you, Urmila. Thank you uh, for all the uh, new uh, uh, members who have joined, uh, taken time and uh, shared their uh, insights and their aspirations. So wonderful to have you in this platform. We're really, uh, as Urmila mentioned, we're looking forward to uh, a very long-term engagement and the idea, as, as you mentioned, uh, Urmila. So it's, it's an ecosystem for aspiring business owners. So we're going to come up with a lot of initiatives, a lot of uh, uh, such, uh, mm, what do you call, uh, in terms of it could be seen as a product or could be seen as a service or could be uh, some mm, uh, pillars of uh, how we run our uh, or execute uh, our uh, um, serve, uh, promises. So th these are the platforms by which we can uh, use and further our uh, business ambitions and goals. So I'm very happy that uh, we are adding uh, like-minded uh, business owners. They can connect and they can make some meaningful uh, uh, business and transactions among themselves. Yes, yeah. definitely. So Casey, like before you, uh, you know, we uh, get into more detailing. My first question to you is like, are you sure that website is a must for a business? Okay. Uh, so yes, uh, I would say one, maybe you can put it in three buckets here. Yeah? The first bucket is, let's say statutory, is government mandated or uh, given us that compulsory cheese aapko website ratna hai, aisa kuch rule hai kya? I feel about two, three cases mein, yes, it is a mandate. Now if you're a listed company, a uh, lot of your invest, uh, investor related information needs to be published in the web website. So there is a format, there is certain uh, protocol we, we need to follow. So for all such companies who are listed and everything, there's a mandate. Now there is a second thing for even for a private limited company. So uh, it is compulsory to have your uh, website and, and uh, certain like uh, your GST details, your website, uh, your address, your location, uh, corporate office be, details needs to be published. So, so even there's a mandate from that side. Uh, third thing, uh, even let's say if you want to do an online transaction, like a payment gateway, you want to sign up with like, Instamojo, PayU and Paytm and all of these uh, platforms. Uh, they are uh, uh, requesting you to po put those uh, terms and conditions, everything has to be published in your website also. So broadly, by statute, at least three, four conditions as a hai we need to have a website, number one. Now if we move to the second bucket, which is, can I use uh, my website as a, uh, a business tool or as a marketing tool? I, I would definitely say yes. It's a, a very important uh, uh, tool for you to uh, talk about your business and, and say how your business is solving certain problems or uh, what your products is, uh, what, how your products are catering to the needs of your uh, potential customer. So I think it's very important on the website. Mein. And the third thing is also, apart from your business side also, we have we need to communicate with other stakeholder, uh, stakeholders also. Like for example, now if you want certain uh, talent, you want to attract certain talent. So even if they want to attend uh, for an interview or something, now they want to actually check with you. If I want to interview mein mere, uh, mein aur mere products and services, if I want to know, they want to know what, what is this company dealing with, what are their product services they are offering, how many branches they have. So even for, for having a me meaningful, let's say, interview also, they need to uh, come to website and they have to gather these information. So if you look at communicating to the st stakeholder or using this as an effective marketing and sales tool, and and uh, sir, mandate also if you look at this everything leads to that one conclusion yes website is very uh, important today and uh, without a website and, and again that's your first interface like anybody who wants to know about the organization you have to think so website become before even they coming to your shop or they doing some business transaction with, with you they would want to know about you and, and website is, is the very effective channel to do so, Urbila, I would say that even in today's uh, time and age, uh, website, in fact, the, the importance of having a website has, has uh, gone uh, higher, not lower, for sure. So, uh, like, then let me understand, even for an established company, like maybe, you know, say a manufacturing company or a services company, even if they are established, 
so for them also it is a must to have a website okay one yes if it is mandated definitely uh, you would want your website to be up and live and it's it's uh, updated now if you're talking about uh, a very established company and they're saying okay the need of maintaining a uh, website keep it updated or spending time and resources and money to make it very effective i think the need is uh, fairly established for for such companies also as i told maybe okay they're not looking at they have few set of customers maybe only three or four set of customers i don't want to use uh, my website as a maybe sales tool or a business development tool here but again it could be for communicating to other stakeholders also as i told you it could be for your interview it could be for somebody who wants to look at doing a jv now you mm-hmm. said you have three customers you never know there is there is a uh, company sitting in, in in let's say europe and they want to look at uh, um, uh, identifying companies based in uh, india and they can be their uh, collaboration partner so essentially what they will do they will go to google they will search okay. companies chemical companies manufacturing companies blah 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 and and if you not present if you not if they can't discover us somewhere we end up uh, losing an opportunity so i right, right. uh, establish you are in the process of establishing whether you are new or two years old 20 years old or three generations old i think the need for uh, having a effective website updated vibrant website is is clearly evident wonderful wonderful and uh, what has been your observation when it comes to like current website design for most of the companies okay right so so i think let us assume in in a uh, number or a bucket of 100 people about 70 80 of them are, are still maintaining a website and yeah so a lot of time i observe that it is it's not updated so they must have started this website let's say 6 years back 7 years back 3 years back uh, there's no attempt uh, which has been done to update that um and even the uh, content so so it's, it's, uh, maybe there are still websites who, who where where the page designs is not uh, matching to the current uh, let's say what we call as mobile friendly or or responsive website so even the pages doesn't respond if i'm looking at a different device if i'm looking at your uh, if i visit your website from a, a mobile or a tab still the the design and everything doesn't adapt to that uh, size of the screen so i think those updates have not happened maybe 20 25% uh, of that 100 numbers we are talking about uh, has not uh, moved to the new age and new designs and when it comes to content and when it comes to yeah uh, i think a lot of work needs to be done for sure because what i understand um, web designing is 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 a little bit complicated the involvement from all the stakeholders are very very high one is it's a new technology so when you engage a, a web designing agency they going to talk about okay wordpress they going to talk about html css they going to say that okay this platform but it's a little complicated so many of us let's say uh, who don't understand technology or or maybe we don't understand those terminologies well it's a little bit of a struggle to take a decision so if you're not able we're not comfortable with certain decisions most of us postpone those decisions मुझे मेरे प्रोडक्ट के फोटोज देना पड़ेगा मेरा प्रोडक्ट का डिस्क्रिप्शन टेक्निकल डिटेल्स आई नीड टू गिव देम सर्टेन केस स्टडीज आई नीड टू हैव सर्टेन मे बी पी डी एफ डाउनलोड्स तो मेरे इवन इफ आई वॉन्ट टू प्रेजेंट माई बिजनेस वेल लॉट ऑफ होमवर्क विच आई नीड टू बोथ इन टर्म्स ऑफ एस एस ए रिटर्न कॉन्टेंट देन जैसे ओके वो आई टी मेम्बर्स उनका फोटोज दो सडनली वी डोंट हैव अ वेरी प्रोफेशनली टेकन फोटोज ओ नहीं सो मेनी टाइम्स क्या हो जाता है when we end up matlab completing the by the time we complete the website bahut sare tu tu me mein jaisa ho jata hai like okay you are not given this data you are not given this so i couldn't do this well so hum client pe hum bolte hain ki nahi nahi aapka website banaya hai aapne itna paisa le liya you guys have not done a good job so it it's even at a business level as as entrepreneurs my involvement needs to be uh, equally uh, there we need to put certain teams and give responsibility to them saying that acha content hai 
give them a 10 day timeline ensure that all the content is uh, delivered images ke liye aur kisi ko aap responsibility de dijiye ensure they are trying because it's my face ultimately my organization's face we cannot be um, very casual about it or we cannot take it very lightly theek hai website se thodi kuch lead close ho jata hai website pe kya farak pad jata hai let's not take why why want to when when i don't i have this opportunity i'm spending money and doing that we need to ensure that we are having the best put forward now to karna hi so we're very clear about it so my observation is somewhere a casual attitude hai and it's not casual attitude aaya hai because unka disposition aise just because the complications are there because wahan creativity bhi hai content bhi hai time bhi jata hai resource lagta hai so thoda wo complication ke wajah se many of us uh, uh, don't do that i matlab don't give our 100 end up giving our 100% there so i would suggest that I know that we are, we are running big plans run करते हैं big businesses run करते हैं तो सब कुछ complication है website को भी उतना ही एक activity या एक ऐसा एक projects ले दिए give it a good two three months time but in, I would suggest that we we need to pay equal attention or more attention to this because this this is our 24 by 7 platform for you मतलब whether your your sales team is sleeping whether doing that at least website can be visited any at any point of time there can at, you would see a lot of people apne own convenience pe they will visit and everything so that means that since that you is giving you the 360 degree visibility 24 by 7 i think putting that effort time and and giving the rare, rare content and everything is is worth that uh effort that is something which is very very clearly uh, documented here. so uh, kc like as a company what are the things that uh, you know an entrepreneur or a business needs to look out when it comes to developing a website like what are maybe there are some like checklist that they can you know uh, go through or how would they know like what they should look for okay so as i as i told you there are multiple components involved in that one is that you use the right uh, technology choose the right uh, platform to to host your website and so what's up comp- component and components there is something called as pella domain so that's the first thing so choose a very simple name straight forward name rakhiye um, as far as possible keep it very relevant matlab even uh, uh, company ka naam pe aisa kuch complication don't have to use all the uh, private limited hai sa hai to ke industries chemical industries private limited hai to i don't have to keep xyz chemical industries karta i can just keep one brand name or something like that pehla ek to domain selection should be very uh, straight forward very yeah, people should remember that second is that obviously it is hosted in a good platform bahut bar hum dekhte hain are ye sabse sasta wala plat uh, hosting hai there is ek to domain ka there is an annual cost roughly about will cost about 1000 1500 rupees uh, uh, per uh, annum so that one cost which will uh, is a recurring cost eh? so godaddy is, is fairly a popular uh, platform very stable platform so you can buy your domains from maybe godaddy.com second we are talking about hosting what is hosting is that getting your server space ki jo bhi aap develop karte ho code likhte ho images dalte ho wo aapko ek cloud space mein ek server leke karna padega so what is there in your laptop aise ek ram gb size everything rehta hai so let's say for example let, uh, mobile ka example lete hain now mobile phones are even let's say entry for mobile smartphones are available at 8000 6000 rupees 7000 rupees But you know that मैं एक ऐप भी क्लिक करूँ सो इट इज नॉट टेक सो मच टाइम फॉर इट टू बफर लोड टाइम इज वेरी हाई सो सिमिलरलीक अ होस्टिंग प्लेटफॉर्म एंड श्योर दैट इट इज इट्स अ गुड प्लेटफॉर्म वहाँ सस्ता मिलता है वो तो ऑब्वियसली वो दो जी बी रैम रहेगा प्रोसेसर इंफीरियर प्रोसेसर रहेगा सो सो एनश्योर दैट यू यू हैव अ गुड डेट देर आर अर टू थ्री गुड अगेन गुड एडिया ऑल्सो हैज अ गुड होस्टिंग प्लान um there are these uh, google ka hai amazon ka bhi they have their hosting plans and everything hostgator karke hai these are fairly good platforms but even usme jab select karoge uh, take a good at least don't get a very high end machine for you at least a like moderate reasonably performing machine select karo so i would say about 5000 to uh, 6000 per annum mein uh, aapka ye cost is also uh, pretty much taken care so two recurring cost hai domain cost which is i said 1000 1000 find it depending upon dot in hai dot com hai thoda price different variation hota hai second i said to hosting hai 5000 to 6000 ka uh, recurring cost hai third is there is something called another cost which is involved uh, what we call as http uh, s what you see as the uh, uh, verification e e uh, uh, 
what you call is that if, if, if it is not verified, you don't buy that, then it will always appear as HTTP. So it will not be called as a secured site. Google will show it as an unsecured site. So the idea of uh, ensuring that you're telling your user saying that the person who's who's bought the domain and the uh, and the and the company is the same domain. It's there's no phishing or there's no um, any uh, spam or scam which is happening through that domain. It's to ensure that identity is maintained, you need to buy. So it's going to cost roughly about two thousand, three thousand, depending upon what level of security you take. But I roughly say about two thousand, three thousand. Your budget will be. So yeah. So these three co- components are your. recurring uh, cost hai and it is more on the infrastructure side mein ye uh, uh, part hai now when it comes to um, the other uh, uh, ye is that now okay maine ye sab infrastructure le liya now how do i present my business right so when you try to present your business as i told you one is content is very very important but usme bhi mera observation has been that when we look at content usme koi ye nahi we we just pick it very straight forward content and content maybe i have seen many of us write about my business what i do many mere achievement i am a 20 year old business mera product mera product mera ye so the attention is too much about me and my company is my achievement which i would say as, as a marketing mind agar karo it's good obviously i want to talk about my product my credentials and everything but my suggestion would be that aap aapke product ko karne se acha customer ko hero banaye Make him the central of the conversation. Even in your website, make him the central. When I say customer, I mean the customer segment. So when when you're saying, okay, I am a let's say a consulting company. Now if I just say that, okay, I am a consulting company. I have been there for 20 years. Now how you will receive that information is very very different because you will consume that word that 20 years in, uh, I mean consulting. I mean based on your experience. आप जितना आप कंसल्टिंग के बारे में आई मीन इवेंट मैनेजमेंट कंपनी यू वुड हैव हैड सम एक्सपीरियंस विद सम इवेंट मैनेजमेंट कंपनी करेक्ट एंड यू विल जज माय बिजनेस बेस्ड ऑन योर मतलब आई एम टॉक अबाउट यू इन द सेंस द यूजर यूजर्स एक्सपीरियंस एंड एंड दिस वे ऑफ अंडरस्टैंडिंग हाउ आई इवेंट मैनेजमेंट कंपनी करेक्ट एंड इट्स अ वेरी रिस्की थिंग टू डू उनके एक्सपीरियंस में अपने हमारा बिजनेस को जज नहीं करना चाहिए करेक्ट so that is why what we recommend is that whenever you you talk about uh, um this this communication part it has to be a narrative part so narrative is about what you want to leave what taste you want to leave in my users mind so it's a very different format how you present your communication i'll i'll just give a very good example abhi news mein tha uh, india has uh, uh, become the uh, fifth largest uh, economy correct now that i can present the same information by two ways one i can say that uh, india has overtaken uh, uh, uk as the fifth largest economy that is one way i can present that information for the same presentation the information i can present is saying that uk has lost to india and have become sixth largest economy so urmila what do you get what is the essence you get in both the uh, communication the first one uh, didn't i felt not very impactful but the second one like they would want to know in what ways we lost like you know how what better we did when to it, come when it comes to uk they would say because we have lost matlab the whole communication about hai humne lose kar diya so yeah. that is putting the ownership on them ki something is lacking in there but like yeah. if the narrative is that india is the fifth largest ye matlab it means that we are achieving we are moving forward wo to apna grow hi kar rahe hain but we are growing in such a pace that it's much faster then what uk is doing uk is maintaining that uh, position so that means one same thing when it is communicated in different manner can uh, set a different theme in their mind so it's very important that the communication has to be in a very very narrow website maybe uh, me 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 i see that usme absolutely no intelligence no attention is played at all so whenever uh, a content is written here hai don't just uh, give this content writing for a website development company to do that because website development company they can they are very strong technical technical but they never they they will never be good at when it comes to story right story tell usko narrative format mein kaisa so i think engage a different content uh, team or a, or a good content writer again not just a content writer a marketing team who can who can actually present your business in a different so let's say now another kal parsu ek news tha uh, ravindra jadeja uh, jadeja's uh, wife raviba jadeja she joined uh, uh, bjp and she's going to campaign uh, uh, for gujarat and, and for a mla ticket 
now let's say it could be present in two format i saw one kind actually it happened that's why i did <laughs> click me there was one newspaper or one news channel mein wo communication aisa tha ki uh, raviba jadeja uh, she has been on ground for 3 4 years and uh, and her hard work has earned a ticket wo dikha raha and it says it and incidentally ravindra jadeja is also the husband who's the uh, popular cricketer is also the husband koi communication tha uske samne there is another communication which says that uh, ravindra jadeja's wife raviba uh, jadeja got a uh, mla ticket so tell me what is the difference in these two communication yeah huge huge difference in the narrative of they've put it across fact the zone of actual yeah right she got the ticket she is going to uh, campaign for bjp and if she wins that she is going to become a mla oh to wo is a factual thing there's no difference but look at how it is been presented she got it because just because she is a who could be or pata nahi shayad wohi ho sakta bhi hai wo natural we will never know matlab only the people who are dealing with that will actually know the real story but ek very story evident hai ki okay ravindra jadeja jade wife hai so oh, uske popularity ko use karne wala one hai agar first communication tha she has been working in the ground for 3 4 years and that has a her uh, yeah. resulted into yeah. so i immediately what it did i went and i was trying to look for some speech of her i was also very uh, astonished the way she was present the presentation she was not like that just like chalo rubber stamp her face aisa nahi tha so the way she was speaking and very aggressive very uh, matlab oh, she could understand the problem how she spoke that means it's not just because uh, she's uh, somebody right saying so how you website mein bhi aapko hi hai i am uh i'm so and so company i'm itna ki itna oh nahi it's about how i am able to solve your problem so uh, just imagine that a customer is going to come to your website he is going to just spend 30 seconds and mujhe us 30 seconds ke andar i need to convince my client or my potential client that ki i am going to solve your problem so if he is convinced in that 30 seconds he is going to spend the remaining maybe another 2 minutes in your website by that means i'm going to reinforce that okay yes i'm in the right place i am doing that and that will translate into uh, trust and uh, and credibility and everything and finally it might he will end up going to a contact page and saying that and then transfer to enquiries correct so it, it's a it's not just ki somebody koi 10000 mein website bana liya chalo usko de diya so as well might well a website ek bana ek domain rakh ke coming so dal dijiye aur just address dal diye it is still better but if at all you want to use it as a business tool and everything i would strongly recommend that uh, ek ek marketing mind mein ek narrative especially when i say how you present your communication so when i say i'm 20 years in business so means that 20 years mein business mein tha that 20 years mein i've seen to too many case studies ko maine solve kiya right so the trust ko create kar rahe translate that just saying that so many of us use these all the jargon trust credibility and all of those things demonstrate in your website na आप ऐसा बताइए कि टेल देम ओके माय एरर रेट लेट्स आई एम मैन्युफैक्चरिंग कंपनी माय एरर रेट पब्लिश दैट डेटा माय एरर रेट इज 1.33 परसेंट और टॉक अबाउट व्हेन व्हेन यू टेल शो 20 टेस्टिमोनियल्स ऑटोमेटिकली वो ट्रस्ट क्रेडिट हो जाता है यू यू वांट योर कस्टमर टू एक्सपीरियंस यू इन दैट व्हाटएवर 3 मोर 4 मिनट्स ही इज गोइंग टू स्पेंड इवेंचुअली इन योर वेबसाइट not just the words words nothing is the uh, register is in your mind words as human minds uh, the way we have been programmed the words kuch nahi aayega aise hi nikal jayega but if allow him to experience that or trust or aapka website dekh ke wo kar ke wo trust wo dikhna chahiye are ha it's a trusted brand 50 500 baat bhi aap trust 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 kar ke not not even a single time that will get registered in your mind but if you just ensure that jis tarah se aap wo kar rahe hain and and i'm allowing them that experience of oh yeah somewhere my um my conclusion be should be that oh it's a trusted guy you should allow him to conclude you don't tell that trust 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 hai wo wo ko nahi so my uh, strong suggestion is that if you just pay attention to these things brilliant things can happen through your website and it's not just your website all your communication all your brochures if you go on a let's say aap kahin exhibition mein jaate ho wo bhi ek ek experience aana chahiye in fact mr sanjeev when he was saying that he had attended one of the event business ba i like them because somehow we need to leave that taste in that consumers mind wo bahut important us pe aap dhyan denge to trust credibility sale everything will start to change yes wonderful wonderful kc i am you know glad that we got this insight from you uh, you know uh, 
the participants who are here with us live if you have any questions we would definitely like to address if there's anything that you would like to ask we would be more than happy to answer yes mr nimish uh, i have a, i have one question like uh, how a member can connect with all the existing members of bll that is my first question okay and you mentioned about the building a trust so i wanted to know how how one build a trust among the members uh, these are the two questions i need your answer Fair thank enough. you so, Uh, should I take that? Uh, yes. Yes, yeah. Casey. Please. So, so when we talk about uh, ICOM as a platform, also, so you have access to that ICOM platform. So there is this button. So if you you're just looking at all the members and you say, okay, I can make a meaningful connection with this so and so uh, member company. So you can just go and say that connect. So that actual request will come to us, saying that Mr. Mini Mini uh, Shah wants to connect Mr. to Mr. X Y Z. And when you put that connect button, you just give one or two elaborate reasons, saying that what, why, why this connection is going to help each other. It's a mutual kind of thing. So then, once we we realize that okay, it's, it's a very good uh, uh, and it's a natural connection. So the whole idea of doing this is that it should, it should not be spam. So there are so many platform available, and and uh, let, let's say now at any point of time we hardly spend any second looking at our uh, SMS to do. I'm looking completely SMS platform se bahar aage because it's not spamming over. right so the utility of the platform itself goes uh, waste so that's why we want to do ensure that ek uh, ek process or aisa protocol banaye jisme uh, both people who are going to get connected and people who want to connect has a very a mutual benefit into that so ek agar establish hoga that request will come to us and we will say okay ek bar quickly ek narration dege and we know that okay then we'll say that the, the administrator will say okay then the request goes as a mail and as a whatsapp message to the पर्सन उनके प्लेटफॉर्म में भी दिखेगा लेट से उन्होंने प्लेटफॉर्म में लॉग इन आज नहीं किया तो वी डोंट वांट दैट ऑपरेटर टू गेट मिस्ड आउट सो इट विल गो टू देयर ईमेल एंड देयर व्हाट्सएप आल्सो सो देन दे सी दैट ओके मिस्टर मिनी निमेश शाह वांट्स टू कनेक्ट विद मी बिकॉज़ एस एस आई प्रपोजिशन उनको डिस्कस करना है सो दे से यस आई वुड वांट टू डू देन द कम्युनिकेशन चैनल विल बी ओपन वेयर यू कैन लुक एट अ म्यूचुअल टाइम एंड एवरीथिंग आप whether you want to meet in person you want to have a telephonic conversation all of those things so dono ka at least mobile number jab expose ho jayega you know at your own convenient time mein you can make those uh, thing hai so again we did, we were restricting the number so every month there are about four such connection request uh, you can make because again kya hai if at all six it's not that i'm going to talk to 20 30 people i say sabko connect kar 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 diya do jan kar raha you also want to have ek jan se mila acha meaningful conversation was so roughly four good meetings aapka is month mein hua i'm sure that that will translate because that's a kind of attention you will able to give to them also because you will go you will meet two char follow up hoga then they last for some product catalogs and all of those things usme aapko thoda time jayega so that's why that uh, platform may it has been designed that way so that answers your first question second in terms of trust so i would not just tell that uh, ki a platform mein kya hai uh, i will in general even for all your prospects who is not even part of the uh, bll platform mein how you can use this as a uh, tool to do that so eventually bll platform may be used ho jayega first important thing is that ki hum uh, when when you talk about trust is that demonstration so you need to identify opportunity by which i am able to allow them to experience that trust as it told earlier also unke mind mein hona chahiye they should conclude that that if i deal with mr uh, nimesh and their company it is trust worthy not about whatever we trade you cannot uh, do so so you need to have that you, there could be about 10 or uh, 5 or 10 such opportunities by which you will able to demonstrate that uh, i am trust worthy or my company is trust worthy number one is that aap jitna transparent information rakhoge ki aap the way you deal as a person your employees your team members जिस तरह से आप उनको कर रहे हैं कि दे फील दे कुछ भी गलत नहीं बोल रहे हैं दे नॉट सेइंग समथिंग व्हिच इज कंप्लीटली मतलब डजंट लुक वेरी रियलिस्टिक और समथिंग वी आर नॉट ओवर प्रॉमिसिंग समथिंग इन फैक्ट इट इज ऑलवेज गुड टू अंडर प्रॉमिस एंड ओवर डिलीवर बिकॉज़ देयर आर द ऑपर्चुनिटी बाय व्हिच वो डिलीवर कर रहा अभी मेनी टाइम्स इफ यू सी ऑनलाइन प्लेटफार्म आल्सो लेट्स से इवन बैंक में भी हम जाके कुछ बोलते हैं कि ओके आई वांट टू चेंज माय ईमेल आईडी दे विल से सेवन वर्किंग डेज but suddenly we say within one working day may or tick ho jata but at least kya hai you know that they have they said seven working days but ek din mein ho gaya matlab that i still feel even if you look at amazon or flipkart may they say okay three uh, days four days but it aapko kya ho jata jaldi aa jata usme kya ho jata trust build ho so they are identified two three points human behaviors they have identified 
जिससे हाँ उन्होंने सात दिन बोला लेकिन एक दिन में हुआ तो नेक्स्ट टाइम भी मैं जब ऑर्डर करूंगा उन्होंने अगर सात दिन बोल रहे हैं तो मेरे को तीन दिन में मिल जाएगा तो वो ट्रस्ट वर्दी कंपनी है ओके सो दैट इज वन थिंग की एंड इन बिजनेस डीलिंग्स में हम ये सब ऑल दी पॉइंट्स भी आइडेंटिफाई रीन फोर्स दैट की मैं ट्रस्ट वर्दी कंपनी हूँ सेकेंड चीज आई वुड से वेन इट कम्स टू कम्युनिकेशन एंड एवरीथिंग एक तो विजिबिलिटी इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट आपको पहले ट्रस्ट एस्टेब्लिश करने के लिए फर्स्ट इज दैट विजिबिलिटी इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट जितना आप आई कैन सी योर यू योर ब्रांड योर कंपनी योर टीम मेंबर्स ने जितना जितने टिके गए उतना मुझे पहला विजिबिलिटी मिलेगी नाउ दैट विजिबिलिटी विल ट्रांसलेट इन टू फेमिलियरिटी मैं बहुत बार आपके बारे में जान रहा हूँ कि कंपनी के बारे में जान रहा हूँ आप कुछ बोलते हो कुछ के स्टडीज के बारे में आप जितना आप कर रहा हूँ नाउ आई एम वेरी फेमिलियर अबाउट योर बिजनेस यू यू एज अ पर्सन में तो आप, आपको जानना मिल गया Now this familiarity will eventually improve trust. Trust because now I'm familiar. I know this person. And now there are two strangers. आप आप एक friend को मिल रहे हो, आप वही एक stranger से मिल रहे हो. I will trust. अगर लेचे आपके पास एक mobile number है, आप want to go to a washroom, लेचे somewhere you're meeting outside. You have your mobile number, mobile with you. Will you will hand over the mobile to him or some some whatever the luggage you have and you want to use the washroom? Obviously, you will give it to your friend because you're familiar. You know that person. So that familiarity is very very important. The familiarity है तो trust आ जाए. And once that trust has been established and जहाँ customer में need है अगर कुछ वो requirement है that will definitely translate into business or transaction or whatever. So typically this is how it works. Visibility translates into familiarity. Familiarity translates into uh, trust and trust eventually will translate into business transaction. and even when you deal with all your customers and potential look at those points bahar which me i can keep establishing uh, that i'm i'm a trustworthy company mere humne bol diya ki aaj ka do din mein aapko main brochure bhej raha hu do din ke andar bhej diya ek hi din ke andar bhej diya so they will feel okay ye hai in our product ke specification mein unhone both positives aur negatives bhi mujhe bataya ha okay yaar these guys are very transparent so i think let that trust be concluded by them Not we keep कितना भी आप बोल्ड में आप लिखिए बैनर में डालिए ये डालिए आई एम ट्रस्ट वी ट्रस्ट वी ट्रस्ट वी वो दैट मतलब इट्स जस्ट जार्गन एंड वर्ड फॉर सो अगर उनको एक्सपीरियंस करने दिया तो वंडरफुल थिंग्स विल है any 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 more questions uh, if not uh, we we can end the session Casey yeah we can yeah great great so it looks uh, you know the the details or the information that we got from you was really very insightful and you know i do look forward to uh, companies that you know will think over it and will understand the requirement for their business through their website you know how how impactful it will be so definitely have a you know if people who've not joined us live view uh, you know watch our recordings understand what your business requirements are and do get in touch with us we've given you our email address we are available our contact details are available on our websites so thank you thank you everyone for who's joined us today who's watching us live thank you for joining the session and i also look forward to meeting you next saturday and before uh, we end the session let's have the quote uh, for the week always give your best efforts even when the odds are against you so wonderful thought and wonderful quote and i leave you to this thank you once again all for joining and i look forward to seeing you next saturday too